One of the great things about climbing plants is that you usually don't need a lot of room to grow them, and by that I mean room on the ground, because the idea is that you get them to grow up and climb, and there are lots of different ways you can use them. In nature, climbers grow on host plants like trees, but in the garden, they need a support structure like a fence or a wall or pergola or an arbor like this that's supporting this dragon fruit. Bit of a funky customer, but the fruit's sensational. You can build your own structure out of bamboo, timber, lattice and the like, or you can grip and grow. These tomatoes were planted recently, but I'm going to do away with these bamboo stake supports because I've got a much better system, and just wait till you see how easy it is. Push it into the ground, and you're done. Where things get interesting are when you need a larger, taller frame, as you often do as your plants grow. The back section of the frame here folds out and up, and then you just join those two together with another one of these spiral connectors, just wind it on, and there you go. And basically, you can add more and more frames and go as far as the eye can see. You can run them close to a fence or a wall, or just have them freestanding. The ribbed bar here provides additional support for climbers and gives them something to grip onto as they spiral up. And these hook ties are also good for additional support for the climber. They can be placed anywhere on the frame and they'll really help hold the vine in place. And the wing design gives extra structural support, which is perfect for some of your bigger fruiting climbers like your eggplants and your cucumbers. And in fact, I reckon these are strong enough. You could easily hang some nice melons off this. Made from durable galvanized steel for a longer life, Grip and Grow is robust and durable enough to reuse year after year. All of the Grip and Grow frames are not only really easy to set up, after your harvest, they can be packed away until next season, year after year. Now, as well as the fold-out frame, there are a few others in the range. There's the spiral stake here for spiral staking. You've got a smaller version of the wing frame, and over here, we've got the curved stake for any curved staking you might need to do. The grip and grow, it's too easy.